Welcome Payraconian. Payracon is now an independent software vendor for Shopee. With Payracon Accounting Integrator, you're able to sync your online order details in Payracon to accounting software easily with just a few clicks. Now we will show you how Payracon integrates with Buku. What is Buku? Buku is a cloud accounting software for Malaysia. It allows you to work anytime, anywhere, with any devices. You can easily sync invoice to accounting system, make payment knockoffs, and create credit notes. Sync invoice to accounting system. To sync your invoice from Payracon to the accounting system. First, go to Carrier Manifest page. Select the invoice you want to pass to Accounting Integrator. Click Send to Invoice. A message will pop out if the invoice is generated successfully. The invoice number will be automatically synchronized from the accounting system to Payracon. Sometimes you may encounter a situation where the invoice cannot be passed. This may be due to the SKU does not exist in the accounting system and the contact name is invalid. Copy this invoice number and check it on your accounting system. This is the invoice you just synced to Buku. You can click here to view the details of this invoice. From here you can see the customer name, shipping info, purchased item, quantity, and price, and more. Make payment knockoff. Go to Pericon's report page. Copy and search for the order number of the invoice you want to knock off. Select it and click, Add to Customer Payment. Of course, you can select all the invoices and, Add all to Customer Payment, as well. A message will pop out to show if the orders has been passed to the customer payment. Customer payment number will be automatically generated. Sometimes you may encounter a situation where the invoice cannot be knocked off. This may be due to the SKU does not exist in the accounting system, the contact name is invalid, and the amount more than the transaction outstanding balance. To check the invoice if it has been knocked off, go back to Buku's payment page and refresh it. And you'll see it. For those orders that didn't appear here, means it has done passing to customer payment before. Another way, you can also check the status of the invoice on Buku's invoice page. The status of the invoice has been updated to paid. Create credit note. The most common situations you usually encounter. That's returned product, damaged product, and cancelled order by buyer. In Payrecon, you can easily generate a credit note. To cancel all or part of an invoice that has already been issued. Select the invoice you want to cancel. Click, New Sales Credit Note, and Confirm. A message will pop out to show if a credit note has been generated for the selected invoice. Credit note number will be created instantly. Now, you go to Buku's invoice page. Here you can see the credit note you just generated. And you'll see its details and amount of this credit note. Go back to previous page. You'll see that the original amount of the invoice and the balance after the credit note is generated. The invoice amount before the credit note is created is ERM 80.30. This is the amount of the credit note, which is RM 75. Lastly, the balance of this invoice is ERM 8.30 after deducting the credit note amount. This is how Payracon Accounting Integrator works when it integrated with Buku. Of course, Payracon Accounting Integrator can be linked with SQL, AutoCount, and QuickBook as well. Thank you for watching this tutorial.